Shibby dooby doo, where are you? We've got a broadcast to do now. Shibby dooby doo, where are you? You've got to be the bell now. Come on, Shibby doo, we can't find you. Are you stuck inside your locker? Or maybe your Wi Fi has made you cry. You've got to see Miss Lester. You know we've got a video to shoot and without you we're running off the tracks. Please come back. And shooby do if you come through you'll have yourself a shooby snack. That's a fact. Shooby dooby do. Here are you. But Darby don't believe ya. You got a demerit. But just don't quit. It's time for Mustang Media. Hello, Mustangs. I'm Mackenzie. Code. And I'm Cora, C Unit Birch. And we hope you had a great Labor Day weekend. Despite the short week, we still had quite a lot going on around school. That's for sure. Hey, Mackenzie, do you know weather? Weather, weather. Speaking of weather, let's send it over to Dylan. Here comes the money. Richmond. Here, Here comes the money. money. Here, Here comes the money. Money, 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 money. Weather, weather. Weather, weather. Rain, rain. Make it rain, weather, weather. If money says it's raining, then you bring an umbrella. Ching, ching, ching. Ain't nobody do it better. The money's coming to you, and he's bringing you the weather. Sup, Stangs? Welcome back to another great week of Brosser weather. It's the most accurate forecast in the tri-state I'm hearing now that D-Money's in charge. Anyway, we got a Monday, we got partly cloudy skies, 70 degree average. Then on Tuesday, some more partly cloudy skies, 71 degree average, so much of a difference. Then 78 sunny on Wednesday, 80 on Thursday. Boy, that's also sunny and then 82 mostly sunny on Friday so we're looking at more sun towards the end of the week that's your weather uh, no rain finally for like the first time in like six weeks but who day thanks see money hey Cora you know I love golf but guess what's even better miniature, miniature golf here we have freshman golfer Landon Ruth let's see how he's gonna do hole number one. Oh, maybe it was the mullet well Webster up next he hits it. Ooh, we're not showing pigs, buddy. Now we have Miss Hensley as the final putter of hole number one. Let's see how she does. Ooh, maybe she should stick to soccer. We have hole number two now. We have Jessica Bell starting us off. Don't trip. Here is Audrey Scharf and... Ah! Let's see if Nate's any better than his brother. Nope. All right, here we have student council secretary Tommy Grosser taking an awfully long time to swing. Ooh, getting violent. His ball seems awfully close to the cup, way closer than all the others. I don't know. I think this behavior is going to have to result in disqualification. Miss Heffernan approaching the hole. Ooh. <laughs> Next up, we have Coach Greeley. Now we are on hole number three with senior Jack Poe. See how he can do on the course today. Oh, rough one. Here we have Derek Martin. Hopefully, he is not this slow on the football field. Any time now. <laughs> now we have Mason Seapate with an interesting approach. And he still misses. Now we have senior golfer Robbie Verst, older brother to Olympic gold medalist Roberta. Let's see how he does. This is his first year of golf. Oh, oh, so. Here we have Henry Goring, a junior. It is in. Golf! Absolutely amazing. Speaking of sports, our teams had a very successful week. 
Let's send it over to Ethan, Natalie, and Shooby Shooby Doo. Hey Mustangs. We had an action-packed week this week. On Saturday, the boys cross-country team ran at Ryle Invitational, placing eighth out of 20 teams. The girls team also ran at Ryle. They tied for seventh place. Miranda Casordas broke the tie, putting the team in front of St. Henry. Also on Saturday, the girls soccer team won an easy game against Paris in the All-A, 10-0. The boys soccer team also won an All-A game, an easy game against Paris, 6-0. The Mustangs enjoyed a great Labor Day and came back for some more dubs on Tuesday. The girls golf team started us off with a win against Highlands, 134 to 145. The boys soccer team also played on Tuesday, beating Walton Verona 5 to 1. The girls golf team continued their winning streak, beating Notre Dame in a close match, 176 to 180. The bo boys golf team also brought home an easy win against NCC, 161 to 175. The girls' soccer team fought a hard, tough game against Beachwood, tying 1-1. to The girls' golf team took an easy dub against the Candle Campbells, 120-141. The boys' soccer team beat the Grant County Braves with a score of 3-1. to Finally for the week, the volleyball team beat Dane in a tough two sets. What a great week for the Mustangs. Let's send it back to Mackenzie and Cora. Hey Mackenzie, do you know what kind of car Yoda drives? I don't know. What kind? A Toyota! That was so funny, I forgot to laugh. Speaking of cars, let's send it over to Bella and Natalie for the best and worst cars of roster. Worst car of the week. week. Okay, here we have Nate Shaw and his 2007 Toyota Corolla. So, what's your favorite part about your car? <laughs> What's your least favorite part about your car? The uh, gas cap the right gas here. Cap. It's really dirty. <laughs> it's pretty dirty. <laughs> nice gas cap. Okay, now we're going to take a car tour. This is the trunk. Got some dirty things in here. A golf club. <laughs> some cleats. Uh, the inside of the car. <laughs> Got some clothes. Shoes. Nice, nice. Got the, got the new radio in here. Oh, uh, not much in there. Give us a little start up. Oh, yeah. Did I just start my car from a horn to work? No. Oh. Ew. That's like a grandma one. Ready? Yeah. <laughs> Great. Best car of the week. Okay, I'm here with Jill in her 2022 Nissan Sentra. So, what's your favorite feature about your car? Um, probably how smooth it drives. What about your least favorite part? Um, it's just kind of low. Okay, now Joe's gonna give us a car tour. Okay. Okay, so pretty basic. I got my hand sanitizer and Central? her Mustang my mom cup. My Mustang mom cup. <laughs> pretty basic. I got a nice little screen. And the back's pretty basic. It has a little charger thing back there. Wipes, always my important. Wipes, yeah. And then just like my blankets and towels back here. Wow, it's a nice trunk. Thanks. <laughs> you ready? Yeah. Is it gonna honk? Yeah. Oh my god. That is a. Vroom, vroom. Man, that was really interesting. You know, that makes me think of something. It's time for the most interesting person on campus Evan Hargit. Okay, I'm here with the most interesting student in the world, Evan Hargit. Now, your name is Evan Hargit. Yes, it is. How many hers do you get? Infinite. Infinite hers. Heard it here first. And how many geese could you defeat? So many. Like so I actually chase geese here one. You do? Yeah. Where's that at? Everywhere. Can I, I anytime anything? I see a goose, I just can get filled with can you call range. me next yeah, time? Yeah, I will. Okay. Gotcha. Alright. What do you have to say to the other Evans of the world? I mean, I don't have to say anything. I, I just know I'm better than them. <laughs> Ooh. Old words. What's your best dance move? Uh, I don't know. I'm a big fan of this one. 
Ooh. It's a pretty good one. True. Fancy. How clean is your lap? It's pretty clean. Mm, nice. That's awesome. Approximately how many bathtubs of water would you say you consume in one month? <laughs> uh, I don't know. At least one. At least one. That's a good number. <laughs> Um, and if you could make one animal go extinct, which one would you pick? Geese. Geese. Oh. <laughs> Keep it great. I could well, then what would you chase? Uh, I don't know, ducks or something. <laughs> move, just move up the bird chain? Yeah. Gotcha. Gotcha. Now, if you time traveled, how would you trick the ancient Egyptians into thinking that you were a god? Uh, I don't know. I'd probably just like... Speak a different language, so <laughs> bring a megaphone or something. Like, oh, <laughs> to be louder. That means you're right. If you're louder, so right. that would work. Uh, how long would food have to sit on the ground before you wouldn't eat it? Uh, depends on where the ground is. That's true. And food. Yeah, I'd see that. All right. Probably just let it scrape off the part. <laughs> just cut it off. Yeah. That's it for this week, Mustang. See you next time. Roll, Roll sense. sense.